guys welcome back to my channel hope everybody's well and looking forward to the weekend i'm just going to take a quick spin around the era i'm going to go through mitcham all the way through to seven island one of the seven islands in mitcham and then i'm going to ride back to my flat so why don't you join me sit back relax and let's go okay let's go guys off we go So guys, hope everybody's well. I certainly am today. Woke up and in, in a very good mood as always. And now I'm gonna do a quick ride. Now, here in the UK, it's a bit gray, as you probably can see. And I wanna try and get back before it starts to rain, because it's, uh, it's anticipated to rain around about say uh, six o'clock and now it's five o'clock so uh, yeah fingers crossed okay let's go through this little gap if i can oh yes let's go through this little gap oh yes nice and steady I'm not going to go past this bus and pass it here. Bit of traffic. So in this situation guys, you just take your time. And push through. Making sure the bus can see me, yes you can. Having us a set of traffic lights. Oh, it's definitely a little bit fresh. I suppose I'll warm up as soon as I start pedaling. So normally I'll go through uh, Bedington Park, but today, no, no. We press on. I'm just gonna warm up. Continue straight, do the checks, look left and right and carry on. Beautiful. Slight wind as well, nothing dramatic. So once again, legs are feeling good. I'm feeling good. Just grateful for all the little things I am. As always, you wake up in the morning and give thanks. I always say it's a blessing when you, uh, when you do wake up in the morning. So I'm gonna do the left here. And all the way down. Oh, I like this. We are descending. Descending all the way down. As per usual guys, I'm on Betsy again. Just to let you know, she's more like my winter bike. And you'll get to see my other bike, which is a Ridley. Or is it Riddle? Riddle. It's a Riddle, sorry. Uh, you'll see that in the summer. Off and out. Happy with Betsy. So guys, what's your week been like? Anything to report? Anything exciting happening over the weekend? If all prevails, I will probably do a, a bike ride to, um, to London. Hopefully, if the weather prevails. If not then, 
I'll have to plan out for another day. Because I know that's going to be a lovely ride. So on the right here, there's a Asda. I used to uh, do my weekly shopping in there. Ever since the uh, situation we were in, the lockdown and COVID, is that a forbidden word to say nowadays? COVID? People still on the, um, the impression that it's not there, but it's, it's still there in my eyes. I've been unfortunate, I've actually caught COVID three times. So I'm very aware of it. And I'm always wearing my mask still in busy places, on underground and on the bus, and sometimes in crowded shopping centers. So still required. So we've got temporary traffic lights here, so I'm going to slow up here a little bit. Nice and steady. And off we go, check the car behind me and push on. I'm just going to try and fire through this. On this road there's a few uh, warehouses down here. There's also a car wash place that I used to, uh, I used to go to to wash my vehicle and now I haven't been for quite a while it's actually saying that it's actually due a wash so I'm, I may do so we're in Bennington the other side of Bennington Going all the way down to Mitcham. Not Mitcham Junction, Mitcham itself. Just another route for you guys to uh, to see. Checking over my right shoulder just to make sure everything's tickety boo. So, what I've noticed with this uh, riding and filming, it's uh, it's always it's, it, it can be seen as um, a bit of therapy. You know, talking to you guys and sharing things. You can really let your your hair down if you want to. I try and keep things positive, as you know, but at the same time, I try and keep it real. Real in terms of, you know, things you, you approach, people you see, situations, you know, real life. Real life as a cycle rider in the UK. So if you're interested in that, then you guys know what to do. So we're coming up to a traffic light, so I'm going to slow up right here. And hopefully I'll make it before I have to unclip. And there's the tram. I've used that a couple of times. They were going to extend the tram, but that's another that's another subject. 
Now what it is, there's a cycle lane to my right. I don't want to use it, so I'm going to cushion over to the left. So drivers can actually pass successfully without moaning. Because what happens is sometimes, as, a, as you know guys, I love a cycle lane. But sometimes, it's on the wrong side. Now I'm on my left, and the cycle, way is all, cycle lane sorry, is on the right. Now, as you saw, I had to make the crossing, and then to come over to the, the right, I'd have to cross again. But that, then I have to uh, stop the flow of traffic, which I find it easier to continue uh, forward. In this case, if it was on the left, the uh, cycle lane, then I would certainly be using it. As you guys know, I love a cycle lane. Best invention for cyclists. As I said, we need more. So I'm just going to feather through this nice and gentle. At the end of this, uh, this road, I'm going to turn left at the traffic lights. Give my signal. Or should I continue? No, I'll continue. I think I will continue. I changed my mind. So now what I'm going to do is follow the road. And I should be coming to the park soon. One of the uh, seven islands. So apparently there are seven islands. The park on my left and right, there are seven islands. At this section. I'll be honest with you guys, I've yet to see the seven islands. I've seen about say four or five of them. Some of the islands are very small. But the one I'm going to see or show you guys is the biggest. This is where I do a bit of fishing. All those fishes out there. I'm sure you guys are looking forward to the summer. I'm sure some of you guys are excited right now, but I'm waiting until summer appears. Because there's nothing more than fishing in the bloody cold. It doesn't appeal to me at all. So for that reason, I am waiting for summer to appear. So there's a mini roundabout here, so I'm going to ease up, unclip, and I'm going to wait patiently. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to carry on forward, and then I'm going to enter the park. on my left. Here we go, nice and juicy. And here we go. A little bit of gravel for me, I think, guys. Let's see how I get on with this. Doggy woggy here. Take it nice and steady. I don't think I'm going to rush this, guys, because I haven't got ro uh, gravel wheels on these or tyres. I've got my road tyres on this, so taking it easy. Oops. So far, so good. So what we're doing is, guys, we're coming up to the uh, the area where I do my bit of fishing. Another doggy woggy on the lead, which I sometimes like to see because when you're riding, 
and you have a dog that's a bit aggressive with people that cycle, they're best off being on the lead, which I appreciate. So down here we go, nice and steady. Sorry mate, thank you. And here we are guys. What I'll do, I'll stop here and I'll take a photo of the, the pond. If only I had gravel tyres, guys. I'll be floating through. But you have to work with what you got. I'm hoping, saying that, to sell... Unfortunately, I may have to sell Betsy, which I'm going to be really upset to, to, to sell her, but... I think I'm going to have to and then get a, a gravel bike. So I've got one road bike and one gravel bike. So I can at least show you guys some gravel trials. Because at the moment, I won't be doing it on this. Hell no. I am just taking my sweet time along here because I don't want to fall over and get dirty. So I'm taking it nice and steady along this path. And it's a very thin path at that, at the moment. But I've enjoyed it. I would have taken you a little bit further into the park, but as mentioned before, I just don't want to get caught in the rain. I'm sure you guys can understand. This week has gone really fast, to be honest with you. I don't know where the week's gone. I still remember Monday. You know, the Monday I did that video about two places of interest. Yeah, that Monday. And now we're, we're at Friday. So the days, the weeks are frightening going so fast. So I'm going to pop out of this park and I'm going to do a right and then a left. A bit of kicking speed. From there I'm going to do a left over the shoulder. That's my Wahoo making all the noise in the world. Oh, that's fantastic, look at that. Whoa. 20 miles per hour road with some lovely speed umps. And off we go. Motorbike. They are as friendly as the cyclists. I won't even waste my time. So this is Tamworth Lane. Near Mitcham. So what I'm gonna do now guys is head down to Tooting and take the scenic route home. And fingers crossed, I can beat the bloody rain. Let's do this, guys. So it's now time for a time lapse.
little bit of gravel <laughs> as I always say along this path Rocky Stevens I'm gonna take a left here And we plow through nice and sweetly. So today, for my dinner, nothing too fancy. Oh, slow down. Thank you, madam. Up this little bridge on the right. And down we go. So what I'll do as well, guys, I will... I'm just getting breath back. I'll put up these statistics. I've got a bit... I've actually got a fly in my mouth. That's it. So I'll display the uh, segment that I've done. It's only a short one, but it's worth showing it to you guys power output speed etc etc <laughs> again along the suckle lane So I'm going to do a cheeky rush in here, guys, and I'm going to take the the uh, the path here because <clears throat> there's no one on it. My house is on the right, so no need for me to ride on the in the road. So, and I only do this when it's completely clear. If there's people travelling or walking, shall I say? on the pavement then I won't do it but if there's no one on it well it's only a two minute ride maybe less than that a minute ride and I'm here so guys once again please subscribe like share comment and I shall definitely see you guys in the next one Adios.